We're beneath the mask from Montreal, Canada. If that's good with you, we're gonna play a brand new fucking song, our seven inch album. Everyone in the back, come closer. This is where the show's going on. This one's called a cast into sleeping. Well, I, I, don't, I didn't know we changed anything, but... Yeah, Sam, I find it sounds a bit like a mix of the, our EP and Dystopia. Our first EP, actually? Evidence yeah, of Inequity and EP. a mix of Dystopia. That's what I think it sounds like. Because uh, yeah. we went more homemade, man. We didn't change the... We didn't do it with Yannick, so we changed it. Yeah, it makes a difference. Yeah, it makes a difference in the sound. Of course, the engineering, we, we, we recorded it with Chris Donaldson this time. So, of course, it made a difference in the sound, like... Like uh, production wise, but I feel electronics. Like <laughs> what do you yeah. mean when you say electronics? Yeah, maybe like it. little parts like an anomic. All right, that's a guitar. Game. That's a guitar. Like kick, 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 kick. oh, that. That's a guitar loop. Yeah, it's just a quote. Yeah, that's true. It's the most. Uh, it's definitely the most melodic album. Like an EP we, we did, that's why maybe it, like, it, it looks, it, it's sounded a little like the first EP because there was uh, quite a few like melodies, melodies in it, but uh, less chaotic than dystopian mechanics for sure. But that's the thing about an EP, you know, you can make some kind of more like uh, concept if you want. We got uh, a lot of we have a lot of material, so it's good. We just have to work with it, and uh, yeah, you know, that's pretty much it. Anxious to get in the studio; it's always fun. Hopefully, it's gonna come out in two thousand eleven. That's always complicated. But, you know, you never know with music. You know, it's like right now, I don't know what what, what percentage of the, the new album we did, but who knows the last percentage? How much time it's gonna take? Yeah, but uh, to be honest, like the the old like black tie and in war thing, BP incident was just like I was already working with the the black tie title, and that when that happened, I, I like the entire EP talks about the absurd man, and when that happened, it was like the best example of like absurdity, like right now the way we live our lives, the way that capitalism changed the entire like purpose of everyone's life and. That's why it's like, okay, Black Tide it is, but it's just, as uh, if Black Tide are trying, uh, BP right now are trying to get the attention away, yeah, whatever, I think the attention is like to every one of us, to each uh, one of us, to look at uh, the way we live our lives, like, fuck BP, whatever. Rock and roll, yeah. baby, rock and Go roll. Go on tour and fucking do what we're doing, insane, man. man. Make some of this <laughs> magic over here. Look at that. Look at this guy's goatee. Just, just, just fucking become a magician. Bring, bring it for the camera. Come on. Yeah, get closer. Let's do it. No, we can't claim that, but, you know, we're just... I, no, I write the lyrics, I write... I don't really care how it's labelized, but it's like... I, I don't think we can it's claim... We can we can't say that because we're not active like let's say our past guitar player quit the band because we were not politically enough like involved involved yeah. like being in protest I mean fuck man we were playing shows and like the the five p.m. Uh, the, the six p.m. news were showing him throwing some like some big garbage cans and some bricks at some high like some big banks in Montreal that was like anti globalization protest that was our ex guitar player yeah. Um, His name is Christian Pepin. Maybe he will present himself at some election soon. Yeah, it depends how you wanna, what, what can you do? <laughs> I think he's in school, I think.
I think it's chloride and magnesium. Because it's too cold, man. Mm -hmm. If you just stay inside, the then you just lowered. That's what you do. Yeah, I think my... Uh, it's the winter, man. It's the winter. Okay, blame it on cold. Cold in good social conditions so that kids can buy guitars and play music. Yeah, yeah. that's true. We can go to shows, not too expensive. And liberal enough, like a uh, place that people can open venues and play shows and fuck that yeah. music. And, and then from there you just need a few bands to be a little more technical. Like, you know, but Montreal, you know, yeah. Montreal and Canada in general, we have like big history of technical music, so. Like for us, I remember a few like in the death metal. If we talk about death metal, like I remember Gorgot's show. A few years, like I was just like, Whoa. that's all you need, you know. After you see Cryptopsy, you're like, Whoa. and that's the first few death metal band we went to see local shows, you know. Mm -hmm. No, I don't think they supported like with. Like what do you mean like uh, programs? Yeah, no. funding stuff. Yes, they do it. Yes, but so seriously, no. we're competing. Like let's say us, we apply for uh, for for money. We're competing against like a fucking like a pop star or whatever. Which they have like lawyers to go get those money. That money we never got one cent from the government. Oh, well, we can't get money either because in Quebec it has to be in French, no? Mm -hmm. It's really simple. Yeah, even there, like we come from Quebec, and I believe it's even harder for. Like us because we're French. You have to sing in French. So we're not spreading the French culture of Quebec. I love that. So no, it's the Nord-Est. The Nord-Est. Nord-Canadien. Canadien. Français. 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 Français, but not French. 